bank was right. They were missing one bag and the robber actually dropped it and I picked it up and I put it back in my car and we're good. Hey, oh, man. Steve. See, oh, good to see you here, Steve. Since I'm an FBI informant, I did have to tell the people. You told the it. FBI? I said, keep it on the down low. Well, guys, I think this is it. The place is surrounded. It's time I give myself up, but I have one last request. Hey, boss man, you got a cell phone? I got a cell phone. You need to come down from there, man. I will. This is I will. Enough. Hey, I give up. I understand you got me surrounded. I just want that cell phone. I got to make one call and I'll give up. Who is this pulling in? We have backup, man. Had a call. Oh, my goodness. Reinforcements. Uncle Buck? Jake from State Farms, is this is how I thought I trained you in my academy? Is this what this has come to? No, you didn't, sir. I let you down. Yeah, you sure as heck did, except the fact that you're standing above me. Well, Get your hindquarters down I, here right now. I give up. I give up. Yes, yes, Sergeant Buck. Yeah, giving up's one thing. Getting down here's another, Sherlock. Get down here. Boss man, give me that cell phone. I gotta make no, one that's call. that's secretary. You can tell him he can have a cell phone when he comes down here. I gotta make one call and I'll what give up. What he said. All right, toss yeah. it up here. Yep. Nope, uh -huh. you gotta come down here if you want it. I know how it works, man. I was a cop as well. Do not get short with me, mister. All right, boss man, come on. Hook me up. Thanks. Got it. Look, it's Steve. He's in jail, too. Wait, you guys caught Steve already? Yeah, we did. He's in the back here. Steve! Steve, come out for a sec. Hello. Oh, Steve, they got you, huh? Okay, go back in. Wow, now. that's, a really, that's a really interesting oh, I like phone call. Like hey, make a run for it, Steve. We'll both no. go. No, no. no, no come Steve, here. Come Steve, here. Steve, Steve. Oh, God. No, y'all okay. got me. Don't, don't make a run for it. Get okay. back in there. All right, guys, just All give right, me I'm a minute. I got to make a call. All right, guys, Sergeant Buck is here. This isn't good. I got to make one call to Chow, to Leslie Chow. If I can remember his number, I think it's 914-3568. Okay, got it, got it. Hey, Chow, listen up, listen up real quick. Stop what you're doing. I'm on a roof surrounded by the police and I'm going to jail. Spencer, Spencer, I never thought it would get to this point. What is up, man? If I were you, I would make a run for it. Prison? It not worth it. I did five years, sold one too many chickens, and they caught me red-handed. Make a run for it. If they catch you, whatever, you just get another six months or something. But if you escape... You live with freedom. All right, Chow. Thanks for the advice. I don't know. They got me surrounded. There's a fence around here. Sergeant Buck. He's here. Very experienced officer. He's probably going to get me. Well, good luck then, Spencer. Godspeed. And I wish you luck, okay? I see you on the other side. Toodaloo, Spencer. Toodaloo. All right, boss man. Here's your phone back. Ben, ah, throw better next time. We're going to need, need that for evidence. All right. Trace the call. All right, guys. I'm coming down the hatch. It, it takes a minute or two. It's kind of a weird stairwell. Just... I'm coming down. I'll come out the front door for you. Okay. Yeah, we got a trampoline down here. Why don't you just jump right off the I don't front? see no trampoline, man. That looks like a broken ankle waiting to happen. All right, All right I'll be make down. Make your way down. Don't try Makes anything. It easier. Here we go, guys. We're jumping. There's no good way to do it. Oh, that hurt. Okay, here we go. He's making a run. He's making a run for it. He's making a run for it. Going over the fence. Don't stop. Here we go. I made ah. it. There he is. There's Buck. Okay, okay. run, run, run. Ah. All right, guys, we got ahead of them. We got to figure out some sort of car. I hate to take somebody's car, but I got to do what I got to do. This probably isn't smart. Oh, no, guys. I don't know exactly where I'm at, but I think I got to make her a swim for it. Here we go. Spencer, we see you there. See you on the other side, boys. Try and catch me. I thought you had the place surrounded. It was pretty easy getting out. All right, I made it to this silo bin. I'm trying to think. We got to think of something. If I can't find a car, I'm going to try and hide out. Okay, let's get up here. Let's see what we got going. I don't see anything. Just open fields. We could maybe make it to the mountains. That's a ways out here. Oh, he's already here. Boss man's quick. All right, let's see if he sees us. He's right below us. Spencer, I see you oh, up there, man. You You're terrible at hiding. Get on down, man. I know you. I know what you do. I'm not coming up there. You're coming down, man. All right, I give up. Do you actually give up this time? I'm coming down. You better be. All right, you got there me. There we go. Against the wall, man. Cuff me. Against the wall. Against the wall. Hands are up. Face the wall. All right, come with me. Don't try anything else. You made me swim for this, man. Yeah, a little workout. You need it. Yeah, okay. So you uh, steal money now, I hear. Come with me, man. No, Keep give walking. me a ride. I ain't walking back. We're literally on an island. Get over here. No, we aren't. I'm not driving. A All right, Buck will be here any minute. He knows the uh. back roads. So, okay, ex explain to me what exactly happened, because you're going to prison for a long time. So remember that guy that made it out on that big red dually truck, and he stole from that bank on a snowmobile and, like, a sled-looking thing? Yeah, yeah, speed up. I, I, I know that part. The FBI told me that one. Okay, well, there was, like, $2 million there, and I accidentally grabbed a $100,000 bag, fell out the back, and I might have taken I it home. accidentally grabbed a $100,000 bag. Yeah, yeah, accidentally. Do you hear this, man, Buck? It fell out. Yeah, I do hear 
All right, Jacob, stay fine. Then... You're going to be right shotgun with me. Don't do anything. Oops. You have the right to remain silent, and anything that you do or say can't affect you in the court of law. You have the right to attorney. If you do not have one, this court will appoint one to you. I have read you these rights. I probably don't know the rest of those rights, but do you understand those rights? Yes, sir. That hundred grand, I brought it back. So I didn't take it. That I doesn't it. matter. So you brought it back, but you still stole money, man. That's the bottom line. Get on in there. How do you steal something but bring it back? I'm done with you. Get on that in there, That don't make man. no sense. All right, I'm going to go and borrow a car from a dealership for, for three days, yep. and then I'm going to bring it back. There you I go. don't tell them that I'm borrowing it. Is that still stealing? Yes. That's borrowing it. I'll meet you guys at the prison. This is a weird ride you got here. Is this, is this all they could afford to give you? It's all they gave me for long, tri uh, long cross county trips. Got you. What kind of MPG you get in this baby? I don't even know because it's electric. Oh, nice. All right. Well, I, I maybe I should have went off road. You wouldn't have been able to get me. So I called Mr. Chow. You know, Leslie, Mr. Chow, you might have dealt with him in the past. Yes, I do know Mr. Chow of Chow Chickens. Well, I called him and he pretty much said make a run for it. He said it's not worth it to not make a run for it. And if you get out, you're free. If you don't, yeah, you're just what, another what, six what months. What got of him of that? What, what happened to him on doing that? You went to, you're right. You're right. I, I think it was probably the wrong call, but it was pretty fun. Officer Secretary, we have uh, arrived on scene. All right, Spencer, get out. Steve, get on out. Am I still an officer in your eyes, Sergeant Buck? No, you're a crook. To get it into prison, guys are going to have to work for it. You guys need to go swimming across the water here in your handcuffs. Good luck. What the heck is this place? I'm surrounded by a moat? Keep on walking. You'll see. Are there crocodiles in the water? This is where you go when you break every law in the book. Solitary confinement? Yes, sir. Close enough. Dang it. Best for the cops, or former cops, I should say. Can't believe you, man. How All much this time, time am with I you, doing? How much time? Depends how good you are in here. Why do we have a garage door on this one if we don't have any way to drive it out of here? Buck, stop talking. All right, boys. I'm, I'm Get asking on in the questions. There. Watch your head. There's some trees. Yeah, I like the... You got nice little overgrown plants in here, but... Yep, deal with it. Must be watering them pretty good. Mm, security cameras. Okay, I see how it works All right. there. Perfect. Both you guys, get in here. Spencer, did I tell you to go out there? Get back in okay, there. Geez. You guys going to wait there till you get your cells ready. All right, 10-4. Wait, I think we could probably break through the walls, no? Well, just wait. Okay, you know, be friendly. Follow the directions. Just look around a bunch. All those security cameras, all that stuff was in the open. Look at the cards they're using to open the doors. So if we want to, we might be able to break out. These guys don't seem to too good well if anyone can break out of jail i think it's me and you i agree all right quiet all right guys your cells are ready all right Come 10 with four. Me. yep absolutely buck get spencer in his cell you'll be in cell block a2 you'll be right here the other yes, one sir. a1 oh we don't even get the same room together that's kind of lame no you oh. don't stay in there doors are shut see you later steve bye this is weird they're looking right at me i'm gonna look right at them buck and boss man Port your cellmate earn five bucks? Dang, you make a killing in here. Make some good money. All right, this is the bench. No pillows. Do I get pillows, blankets, anything? No, you're going to be in here for 22 hours before you get out for a small little break. And then we're going to get you right back in here. And you're going to enjoy that. You like stealing money now, Mr. State Farm? I like borrowing it. Yes, it's very nice and giving it back in full. But anyway, I'm going to take a nap. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for catching me, I guess. Fuck. Who's the Did one you that instructed you? Yeah, I checked his cell. Okay. You gotta remember, I'm still your superior, Mr. Secretary. Not in here, you ain't. <laughs> Wanna bet? That's boss man fight, for you. Fight, 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 Spencer, fight, Spencer, get fight. out of this. You need to Do just I need to throw you in talking. cell block A2 for assaulting an officer? Fight, 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 fight. Spencer, you're not helping Steve, here. start it. Fight, 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 fight. fight, fight. 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 I get right. enough to deal with you, boneheads. Ah, he's scared. He's scared. No worries. Okay, you guys stay here. We'll be back in a few hours. Don't try anything. Hey, Steve started the fight chant. Can I get five bucks? Goodbye. Just report your cellmate. Earn five bucks. Just kidding, Steve. I was just trying to make some money. I would have split it with you, man. Well, what the heck were you going to do with two and a half dollars? I don't know. You can add it up over time. I'll talk to you to, tomorrow, man. I'm going to get some sleep. I'm, I'm tired. I, yeah, <laughs> running away from cops is definitely an exhausting thing to do. Yeah. All right. See you, man. The door's opening. Good Bye morning. Boys, chill time. Let's go. Food, I'm starving. Nope, 6 a.m. You get to eat at 8. Let's do this. All right. Where are we going, Sticking man? Sticking the schedule, boys. Heading for a little exercise. Hey, quit quit pushing me like that, man. I'm, I'm trying to follow hey, along. come over this way. Keep moving, guys, faster. I want to see you guys running here. I don't have to run under your authority. <laughs> Not you. Hey, what That's is what that about? Get. That's you, what you, you get. You want another year? 
How many years have I getting? Nobody told me nothing so far. We're deciding that today. I'm thinking three, but maybe after that you're getting four. Are you All right. a judge or something? You guys have a basketball? Now if you throw it at each other, that's an extra two years. So don't do that. What if I throw it at you? That's an extra six, six years. What about me and Steve versus you and Buck? If we win, we get here scot-free. If you guys lose, no, no, you're in jail. Enough of you guys are not getting out of jail scot-free. Not happening. Never, ever, ever. You know what, boys? Instead of playing basketball, give me some laps around this place. Let's go. <laughs> Run along the fence. Spencer, you too. Come on. Get moving. <laughs> This will only oh, make I'm me stronger. Enjoying this. Yes, sir. When I'm done with this, I'll be able to run laps around you. Keep going. Nah, the white fence, boys. You guys are running big laps here. There we go. Like to see it. All right, Steve. We're going to get really fast, and then one day we'll just jump this fence and make a run for it. They'll never catch us. Is that you guys talking over there? Nope. That's what I thought. It's chow time. Let's get inside, get some food in your guts, and then uh, we're going to watch you complain. We're going to get you your sentences today. Keep it moving. What are we having for food? Sloppy Joe's? Oh, you yeah, think you this wish. is grandma's cooking? You get no, some you're oatmeal. getting mash. Bean soup? That's my favorite. Back in your cells, we'll tell you guys when you can come out. All right, I'm ready. Now, in your cell, Dang you it. don't get to eat on the table. What do you think this is, a five-star hotel? All right, Spencer, get on out of there. All right, 10-4. Back in there, Steve. With us. Here you go. Steve, Steve, Steve back Steve. in yours. Don't make Why me. Yours? Why can't I come too? Now Don't I feel because this is a trial for him. Do you want yourself. to add to yours? Fine, be like that. All right, Spencer, here's a granola bar. Time for us to figure out how many years you're going to be in this joint. Former Officer State Farm here. Colleague Officer Bossman here. Current has your current list of charges. If you would like to read that out, we can be uh, judging what the amount of time your sentence will be here on this precious island. So, Officer uh, Bossman, if you'd like to read those uh, alleged charges out on our prisoner here, that'd be spectacular. State Farm, are you listening? Yep. You're being charged with one count of fleeing from the police, one count of resisting arrest, two counts of stealing money, because we can charge you for twice, because why not? There's no proof. And that's about it. That's it. Oh my god. What else can we charge him with? What people do you... What do you, part about this do you not understand is actually serious? You're going to lose every property you own. Do you realize this? Any bill you have, the bank's just going to start taking what you got. So, so I, I your own a house, house. Yeah, that house is going to be gone. Your shop, your cars, hey. everything. Yeah, yeah. Good luck with that. My shop's not in my name anymore. Sold my cars 12 hours before. Everything you own, besides for what? You're saying your house? You just got rid of last second. All right, I'm going to quit talking. Oh, my lamps up. All right, we're going to keep that one in the books. Man. Members of the jury, All do right. you find this man guilty or not guilty? Yeah, I think We have reached guilty. a verdict. Guilty. All right, you're guilty. Get back in your cell. How many years Stay do I got? You will be charged on a spaces. You will have a four-year sentence. What? You will also be a having a $100,000 bond if you would like to pay that, if you would like to have an early leave. You know what? You guys are switching cells. Why? I like this cell. This Here. is my home now. See you, Steve. I like this. Oh, there's a picture of Boss Man right there. Well, today's the day. My last day. Four years went by. So slow. And hopefully Buck's here any minute. He's going to let me out. Steve, today's my day. I'm getting out. Oh, my God. No way. Congratulations. Thank you. How, how much more time you got, man? Honestly, I don't even know what day it is anymore. <sighs> well, good luck, man. I'll see you on the other side. Jeez, morning, sleeping beauties. How are we doing this morning? I'm we learned our lessons finally? Yes, we have. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, the good news is you're going to be getting out today, Spence, and, but we're not going to be doing your stuff, Mr. Steven, until tomorrow. So you're still going to be in here for another day. But you will be out of here by about 5 o'clock this afternoon, Mr. Spencer. What? I thought I was what? getting out right now. You thought you were getting out right now? Well, well right now we got a lot of bookings to go right through right now. We can't get everybody right now. Fair enough, fair enough. Yep, a couple more hours won't hurt. I hate to inform you of this, but your former colleague, boss man, has actually turned in his badge. He is no longer with the law enforcement. He will not be here. He will not be assisting you. He has moved out, and he's uh, just doing his own thing now. Well, we have your stuff. We have all your stuff over here in the main office lobby. We'll need you to sign some paperwork, and then where you are basically free to go as a free man. So here's your documentation. I need you to write down your information so we can get you cleared. Uh, your stuff will be right back there in the lockers, and then you can get your stuff and go. Ten You're free four. to go. Sergeant Buck, I want to say thank you for treating me so good. It was a little rough at the beginning there, but over time, oh. you were actually a nice corrections officer. I appreciate it. 
You're welcome, sir. People are still human beings, even if they choose to do things not the smartest, but you know, we, we all learn. We learn from our mistakes, and I hope that you learned about yours. I know this means you will never be able to basically uh, apply for an officer law enforcement uh, position again, yep. but I hope you learned your lesson, and I hope I don't have to see you here doing this same thing again. Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I served my time, feel like I did my time, and then I did. Uh, I'm a new man for it. That's good. Now get your keister out of here and get into the free world. Thank you. Can I give you a big no hug? problem, sir? Yes, sir. Come here. Oh, there you go. Now, don't do anything that I wouldn't do, all right? Like I said, I don't want to see you back in here We're doing this same thing again. 10-4. Let's shake on it. Put her there. Yes, sir. All right, sir. We'll see you. I'll talk Have to you later. Day. Hey, do yep. you get a car or anything? Yeah, if you go back across the uh, the river on there, we actually have a vehicle for you ready to go. It's actually ready to, uh, if you wanted to start doing some business with it, go right ahead. Uh, we actually, uh, by the time, by what I've heard of my walkie is that we've sped up some of the process, so Steve is able to get out today. So we're going to do the same thing getting out with him, so if you kind of want to wait for him, we can get him out of there too, and you two can roll, roll together. 10-4. All right, Steve, water's a little cold, just swim fast. Don't worry, we're free mans. That's right. Congrats, man. We made it. Yeah, it feels good to be out. That was a long four years. Jeez. It was, but definitely not the worst prison I've ever been in, so. No, they got nice later on. At, at first, they were a little rough on the edges, kind of pushed us around a bit, but these are our cars. Pretty impressive. Mercedes, what the? I've never even seen this before. It looks like it's got some sort of ramp deal, but anyway, I guess this is what we get. This is awesome. And I still have all my mechanic ability, so I That's think I, we might have to just, just spiffy them up a little bit. And I did a little uh, business transaction. Remember when we were making a run for it four years ago in one day? I actually had, you know, I had quite a bit of money. I was trying to make a million bucks and I sold all my cars, sold all my businesses, took that money, put it into a buddy's name in the bank. So it looked like I had nothing. They couldn't take anything. So I'm going to get that money. Oh, smart guy. Yeah. That's a good plan. Here we go. We got it. And now we can start kind of doing some things. While I was in prison, read a lot, came up with a lot of business ideas. Still trying to figure out exactly what we want to do. So today marks a new day. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was a long four years, but happy we did it. And I learned my lesson. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know in the comments what business we should start, what we should do. We're going to try and make a million bucks as soon as possible. We got a good start, obviously. See you in the next one. Peace.